Damani, now that just the entire fall camp is over and your mindset's going toward week one, is there a sense of just relaxation to know that there's finally real football to be played? Um, I wouldn't say relaxation, but I will just say like a more of an urgency because um, we have to get ready for the game. Um, everything matters now. Um, so I wouldn't say relax. I feel like I'll say like it's more intense, so we have to like be ready and like get ready to play. And then a program like Sam Houston, they bring in a couple of transfers from the FBS level. They've been to the FCS National Championship. They've been deep in the postseason. When you face off against a team like that, is there little margin for errors because if you know what they're able to, what they're capable of? Um, I'll say, you said like, what do you mean by little margin of errors? Like because of the way that the talent is built there, mm -hmm. it's almost matching to what you guys can Oh yeah, right. Yeah, so I feel like any any week it's like little margin of errors. So. We just have to um, go to practice, practice the right way, um, and uh, we'll just um, do that. Stay in the front, right here, Travis Brown from the Eagle. What's it been like so far working next to uh, Jordan Gilbert, and, and what does he uh, bring to the defense so far? Um, Jordan Gilbert, he's a very smart guy. Um, he's athletic, um, jumps out the gym very fast. Um, I, so I just like know he's like going to do his job. He's always in the playbook. Um, he has instincts. Um, he just he's just a good player all around, but he's um, the main thing he brings to the table. He's like he knows like where like people is going to be. He knows a lot of people up. Um, he knows my job. He knows and like everybody else's job. So it's like another I have another quarterback of the defense. We'll go back to the back row to Tyler from KBTX, and then Brent. Damani, what's impressed you about this defense the the most um, you know, during fall camp, and just kind of what are your expectations as the season starts? Um. I, the unit that impressed me the most is the D line. Um, they're like very, they're fast, quick, and like strong. Um, they have a lot of depth, so everyone's making plays. Um, overall, I would say the depth. Um, we have a lot of depth at DB, um, D lineman. So I just say like the depth and the the talent level is like um, it's good like all around. Like you know, we have like a lot of people that's good. Down front to Brent Zornerman from the Houston Chronicle. When Haynes King broke his leg last year, how much did it mean to the team to see what he did? He was still around. He was on his little cart. He was helping coach things up. How much did that mean to the team at that point as well? Um, to me, it just showed how dedicated he was to being a leader and to just being with the team. So just showing um, how much of a team player he was and just how, um, like how much the team means to him. Questions? Go back to the back to Justin Woodard from KAGS. TV row on the right. Money. Couple quick things. Uh, Sam Houston, they got a Georgia Tech transfer quarterback. Uh, not sure much film you watch, but when he's in, obviously his running ability changes things. So as a defense, if he's in the game, what, what does that what does that do for you guys? Um, just keeps us on our toes, not having us like to relax when the quarterbacks like get. Sometimes when quarterbacks don't have an option, sometimes quarterbacks don't have an option to, to run a ball. So just having that option just keeps us like on our toes, having to plaster our man when we're man coverage or just in, in like coverage. So it just keeps us on our toes and um, like we just know he have that extra ability to, to run the ball. And then just experience in secondary, for you guys, you know, in the back end, I mean, how, how good can this group be in the back? Um, the sky's the limit. We have a lot of depth. Um, we have a lot of playmakers. Um, people, I feel like people um, have have like shown. I I mean, shown like they wanted to win. I, how much they shown to win. Um, I just feel like they care. I care more. So I just feel like the sky's the limit. We just have to practice the right way and get better like, each and every week. Let's go left side to Naomi from the Dallas Morning News. So what is the focus for defense going into this week with an offense like Sam Houston's? Um, our main focus is um, they have like kind of like a tempo offense. So our main one of our main focus was to um, get lined up, um, get ready to play. Um, another focus that we have is to contain the quarterback. So just not allowing him to um, gash us for big runs and um, plastering our man and having like the D-line to like stay in that rush lane. So I like, just trying to contain him. Stay on the left side. We'll go to Robert Cessna from the Eagle and then Colt. So now that your senior year is here going in, do you feel a sense of urgency, confidence, uh, got to get something done? What is, what is your mindset going into your last year? 
Um, I, my mindset just, um, I feel like I have a lot of urgency now. Um, I'm much more urgent. I'm trying to be as like much of a leader I can, so people won't like feel like it's time. Like we have time to do anything because when you like when you have like feeling like you have time, like you get like behind. So I'm just trying to be a leader and um, just push the young guys and um, yeah, just like pushing the young guys and just having like much more urgency with everything I do. Got time for a couple quick ones. We're gonna Cole and finish with Tyler in the back. Damani, you kind of talked about the right down front. Uh, you talked about kind of the, the defensive line and how you've been impressed with them. But for the freshmen that have come in and been a part of this entire summer process, have you noticed a more mature aspect of them, especially with guys who are already in the program starting in January? Um, well, like in the past, I feel like um, it's just some maturity, some unmaturity. But I just feel like I, like the main thing that sticks out with me, to me about them is just the talent level um, and how much – Talent, like talent they bring. I feel like there's going to be some immature guys, mature guys. So I just, to be honest, I feel like it's about the same. But I just feel like the talent wise, they're being like they're like much better okay, let's, overall. Let's go back to the TV road to Tyler, and we'll finish it up. Demani, how important is this this season opener as a first game to just kind of set the tone for the defense? Um, you know, as the year goes on. Um, I feel like it's very important. We just have to. We always have to start anything we do the right way. So just um, doing this, like starting the right way at this game, just like shows like how dedicated we've been at practice and like throughout the off season. So just setting the tone the right way this first game just allows us to um, get rolling during the season. All right, that's it, thanks. All right, thank y'all.